Hello, you guys. Oh my God, long time no update. I'm in Iowa City. I drove here today. I got coffee with Hannah. You guys saw that this morning. Did a Tasha and then literally just like drove here and went straight and saw my girlfriends and we went to Revival. I got this sweater. It's um, cashmere from Nadam, um, but it's so cozy. And I got another sweater too that I'll show you guys, but I'm gonna be late and heading up to my mom's for dinner. I'm staying with my dad while I'm here, um, but I'll be here for the next couple days. So I don't even know if I ever intro this vlog, but if I didn't, welcome. Um, if you're new here, I'm Mary. I post fashion, beauty, and health and wellness videos. And this is my little Thanksgiving vlog. I'm gonna go to Naperville, cause I work Black Friday, so I'm gonna go to Naperville on Wednesday and do Thanksgiving with Blake's parents, um, Blake's family. So I need to lint roll because I have this thing. Where did I put my lint roll? Anyways, I had to lint roll because I have an aversion towards lint. Like I get so freaked out if my leggings are like the slightest bit linty. Good morning, you guys. Um, I don't even think I vlogged last night. We had Mexican for dinner. My whole family was up at my mom's. Um, oh my god, my hair. I use a different shampoo and it's like so dry now. I need some oil on it. But anyways, I use the Shea Moisture Shampoo. Kourtney Kardashian loves it. They had it at the Bright Garden. So it's like a like more affordable natural shampoo. But anyways, I think it's kind of drying. Um, but I am going down to get a coffee. I did not sleep well last night. In all honesty, I have, a, I have a really bad headache right now. Hello, you guys. I am going to meet my dad. We're going to Costco. I went to a sculpt class this morning, and then I've just been doing some work on some TikToks that I want to get up <sighs> and stuff like that. Um, my I have the worst body aches. It's so frustrating and like i don't know what it's from so if any of you guys ever get body aches this happens to me like i don't want to say frequently but it happens when i come home like i think and i think it might be sleeping in a cold room with heavy blankets i don't know why but it always happens when i do that and it's like like if you guys get body aches you know they're the worst like ugh. i thought that going to like moving and yoga would help but now my hips are just even more sore so I'm just taking it easy. My dad and I are going to Costco. Um, Cause I always, hi. Good, how are you? Cause I always do a Costco run when I'm back. And I don't know where my dad is. Dad? Oh, he's in his car. I was like, where did the man go? Um, but I never finished telling you guys about last night. We did Mexican for dinner. It was so fun. My dad came over. I'm just so grateful that like my parents, though they're divorced, they're like such good friends. Like it just, I don't know. It means a lot to me. Hello, you guys. I'm chilling in the bath, doing a face mask and a lip mask before we go out to dinner. Um, my dad and I went to Costco and I got a ton of stuff. I didn't even vlog there because it was literally insane. Like, I'm not even kidding, it was crazy. Um, so I got a lot to make homemade granola bars so i picked up like organic oats maple syrup um they have chocolate chips that don't have added sugar so i got those i got dates i got macadamia nuts pecans um more uh, paper towels <laughs> um more batteries um what else did i get pickles more seaweed um oats if i didn't say that already and that's pretty much it i might have picked up a few other things oh some body wash um i got the honest company body wash and yeah but we're going to joseph's our whole fam is for dinner tonight but i wanted to just like relax and get in the bath so i'm just gonna be in here okay. yeah i'm yeah i'm vlogging um, and I'm going to read my book. Um, that's my, oh, he's talking to the dog. Good morning, you guys. I just, um, obviously I did my Tasha this morning and then I went for a walk with one of my friends from high school. Um, 
which was really good. He lives in LA now, so it was fun to like catch up with him and all of that. Um, he actually, some people are gonna think this weird. I don't think this is weird at all, I, but whatever. He's actually my ex-boyfriend, so we dated for like two and a half years, and he's a great guy. Like, that's the thing is like, I think that it's very, my sister received a question the other day on her health and wellness account, and the person was like, is it healthy to be friends with your ex? And she was like, 100% it is, if it can be. You know what I mean? Like, some people, they can't be friends with their exes, but I think especially if a relationship starts as a friendship, then it can end as a friendship. And so, like, for us, we were really good friends for a while um, before we dated. And so, I think that that has enabled us to, like, maintain such a great friendship, um, even though, like, we're both with different people now. So, it was really great to... Um, talk to him and now I'm gonna run to um revival and prairie lights and just do some bebopping around town um I really want to see if revival has a pair of just black denim jeans but um we'll see that's the plan but anyways back to being friends with your ex I think that it's all about intention you know what I mean like if your intent is to like maintain a healthy friendship with them and like have clear boundaries obviously and like if that relationship romantically served its purpose in your life and like you feel like a friendship could still serve a purpose and I think that that's like when it's really healthy but I think that also a lot of people will be friends with their exes in an unhealthy way um, which I totally get and like there are people that I have been in relationships with well, not even been in relationships, but like talked to that like I couldn't be friends with, you know? So, I think it's just knowing your boundaries. Um, but yeah, I really wish that I didn't have to head out today, but I'm going to. I'm going to head to Naperville and spend Thanksgiving with Blake's family because I work Black Friday. I don't know if I told you guys that. Someone's calling me. Grayson! guys and hi I don't even know the last time I vlogged but happy Thanksgiving I am currently at Blake's parents so I think I told you guys that I <clears throat> I think the last time I vlogged was probably I went to Revival and I want to show you what I got I got these little earrings I think they're so cute for the holidays like I just think they're so fun. Little like golden green. And then I got this cutie hat that I'm actually gonna wear. We're gonna go get coffee, so I'm gonna wear it. It's just green and like for a little cashmere moment. Super cute. And then I went to Prairie Lights and I got this book. It's a new devotional and it looks so great. And I didn't show you when I was with my dad. I actually got the second one to Jesus Calling, Jesus Listens. And this one has been so good so far. The reason I got it was because I'm almost through the whole year of Jesus Calling. And I was like, oh, it could be nice to like have both, you know. And I can't figure out how to get this sticker off. So let me know. But yeah, that's kind of in the vibe i'm here because i work black friday so we're doing things sitting here and then head back to the city tonight um i'm wearing these little eye masks they're so great um i took them from my mom's and i'll show you guys the brand it's skin medica but they're little brightening eye masks and i don't know how they're gonna be these are them i left this here because i wanted to show you guys it but um other than that, we're going to go get coffee. I'll bring you guys with. I'm actually going to take these guys off. Right now. And put on a little bit of moisturizer. I feel like a little bit groggy, but... 
I slept, I slept really well, so that's not it. But okay, I'll be right back. The owner just gave us this and it looks fire and smells fire. Hello you guys. So the last time I vlogged was Sparrow, but we ended up after Sparrow, like we were literally just with Blake's family the whole day and I wasn't gonna vlog, it was Thanksgiving, so. Yeah, but we just got home, got unpacked, got showered, got my laundry in. Like that's literally like my necessities when I get home. Like I need to unpack, and get laundry going and shower like those three but anyways now we're just chilling blake's family does like a thanksgiving lunch so right now it's like seven but blake made me a little sparkling water with lime and he made himself a little drink um and i wanted i have some updates for you guys okay first thing so i showed you guys my sister and i making sourdough she gave me a starter so I am making sourdough now and this is the starter and I'll let you guys know how it goes this I just fed it so it's just gonna sit here but anyways that's update number one and then update number two is that I have a couple of hauls for you guys oh. nothing like insane intense but two brands that I'm actually working with one that okay one that i am working with one that i'm possibly working with if i like the product they just like reached out to send it to me so i wanted to pop on and show you guys the hauls okay the first one is i'll do the like more chill one first the first one is a company called david's toothpaste and it's all natural toothpaste they like sell it at target and stuff and they reach out to me and I've heard really good things. My sister has heard good things. Blake has heard good things. So I was like, honestly, yeah, sure, send some over. So they sent me some toothpaste to try. And you guys know I'm an all, like a total natural girl. Question. Yeah, what's up? Do they have fluoride? I don't know. We're about to find out. Um, but now I can't get the box open. There we go. Okay. David's, ooh, kind of cute packaging. Very cute. Okay, so whitening anti-plaque fresh breath. Fresh breath. Fluoride free, sulfate free. Natural peppermint, cute. How is this one different? Oh, natural spearmint charcoal and peppermint we have toothpaste for years um herbal citrus peppermint and another natural peppermint so we've got five toothpastes to try They're different um, this one doesn't say natural oh it says natural though on the front natural spearmint Natural peppermint. This is sensitive. Oh, that's great. I have sensitive teeth. Okay. The oh, yeah, second this is one. For sensitive teeth. Oh, cool. The second one is from Majuri, and I'm working with them on my TikTok, and I'm so excited because I absolutely love Majuri. So this is like really cool because they're a brand that I've literally like written about in my scripting journal, and it's like come true. So that's amazing. Um. I'm super excited. So I picked out a couple things that I will show you. So cute packaging as always. You guys know I love Majuri. Like I've been buying their stuff for years. I literally called like when they reached out to me. I was like, oh my God. So excited. So, okay. We've got a little Majuri box moments. And a jewelry polishing cloth, which I love keeping these around because um, I think it's so important to polish your jewelry just to maintain the longevity of it, especially like high quality stuff like Majuri. And it's good to travel with too. So, yeah. Oh my gosh, Blake, will you come put this on me? Okay. It's a little bracelet. The first thing is this cutie. 
little bracelet. Will you come here? Yeah. Just waiting for you to get it on. And you can see it's super dainty, which is like my total vibe. I absolutely love it. I'm going to put it on with these guys. You want to put it on? Mm -hmm. And I love it. And I'm like so grateful. I just feel so, I hope you guys like enjoy these kinds of hauls too. Um, and like I hope you guys know like I'm so, so grateful for. Do you want on that or you want the tighter one? There isn't a tighter one. Oh, there is a tighter one. Yeah, I want the tighter one. Um, and yeah, I'm super excited because the campaign I think that I'm going to do for them is going to be really cool. I want it to be super like low-key festive, but also like city girl. I'm thinking like a silk shirt will be in the mix. Is my wrist small? Okay. That oh, that's tight? no, it's so cute. It's perfect. You can see super dainty and like this my other bracelet is majority too and they just go oh it is together. yeah that my girlfriend's got me and, and you got your it. ring um oh yeah and this ring is majority too okay the second thing is a little out of my comfort zone in a good way so oh my god these are fun these are so fun they're earrings and I'm gonna actually put them on tonight. And they're little pearl climbers. They're coming out on December 6th and they climb up your ear and I think they're so fun. Aren't they cool? Mm -hmm. Like they're so like out of my comfort zone but I love a good pearl moment. So I was like, okay, full send with this. I'm gonna put them in and then I'll come back and show you guys in a second. Okay, so these are them. They're little pearl climbers and I think they're fun. I really like them. What do you think, Blake? I do like them a lot. Aren't they cool? Yeah, they are. Yeah, they're really cool. Okay. I'm going to go. I'm going to end this vlog. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. And today on Thanksgiving, I'm just like so grateful. And I'm just thinking about how grateful I am for each and every one of you. Like seriously, the comments I get, the messages I get on Instagram, like all of that means so much to me. And I literally love you guys so much. So thank you to all of you who made it to the end of this vlog and I will see you on Monday in my next vlog and then we're starting Vlogmas, baby! Woo woo! Okay, don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already done so. Bye guys.